everybody welcome back to my channel my name is Tanya if you're stopping by for the first time then thank you and welcome I hope you will consider subscribing and if you're not stopping by for the first time then thank you so much for your support today's video will be my first ever collaboration video and my collaboration video will be with the ever so beautiful smart talented wise grounded practical yet sassy Katie Cadell Katie Cadell she is absolutely beautiful. We have become fast friends in, I'd say, the past year or so. And she's the type of person that I want to be if I'm ever young again. <laughs> she is a beautiful young woman and she knows what she wants. She's experienced. She's traveled. She's aware of herself and her goals. And I admire that because not many young people have that. So... I reached out to her and I said, hey, Katie, right? But she reminds me of a younger version of myself without all the experience and the travel and luxury items and all that sort of stuff. But anyway, I reached out to her and I said, Katie, I've got an idea. What do you think? Would you be interested in doing a collab with me? And she said, oh, yes. Oh, yes. And I said, oh, great. So I suggested that we show something that is special to us. It can be a luxe item or doesn't have to be a luxe item, but has a luxe feel to it for us, for ourselves, if that makes sense. So it could be something that we've not shown you before. could be something that maybe we have shown you before. could be something that perhaps, you know, uh, you don't know about or you know about but may not have seen. So, you know, the, the parameters were pretty broad. So this is what we're going to do. So I will have Katie's video linked below. And if you are not familiar with Katie, please head over to her channel, subscribe, give her some love, tell her I sent you, tell her I said hi. And I know for a fact that you will find her channel very entertaining and very informative. If there's anything that Katie is, is definitely informative and well-researched. So let me get straight into the items I'm going to share with you. Okay, before I start, can we just admire the pink cushion here behind me because my daughter Talia said to me just the other day, she said, Mum, you know what you should do? You should use my pink fluffy cushion behind you just to improve your aesthetic. And I said, sure, Tals. Thanks. I'll do that. And so just earlier when I mentioned I was going to do a video, she said, hang on, you need my cushion. I said, oh, my God. My daughter's my manager. <laughs> uh, I have three items to share with you, but I will keep it brief. The first item is a vintage piece, and I know it's vintage because this was given to me uh, a very long time ago. A collection of beautiful vintage jewelry pieces were given to me by a neighbor that I pretty much grew up with, and her name was Dawn, and when my parents had their business in an inner city suburb in Melbourne, right next door to Dad's shop was a pharmacy, and Bill was the chemist. The, the chemist, the pharmacist, and his wife Dawn used to look after the front of house pharmacy, an old school chemist, old school pharmacy. Anyway, and um, I always used to talk to her, used to go visit Bill and Dawn all the time, used to share information with them, used to just head over and chat. So anyway, they moved to Queensland many, many years ago, and Dawn left to me a beautiful collection of her costume jewelry but still beautiful nonetheless and these are original pieces from the 50s and 60s so the first piece i'll share with you is this beautiful silver choker as you can see here it is stunning it is very reminiscent of that film and i always forget the name of it oh, leonardo dicaprio 1920s he's very rich I can't remember it. I'll put the name here. I always forget. That movie is a guaranteed movie that I can never remember the name. So you'll see this is a, just a beautiful silver tone choker. The detail on this item is stunning and it just sits in place. It doesn't move. I just adore it. I love chokers. I love necklaces that are chunky. I love necklaces that make an impact and this is definitely one of them. So you'll see here the absolute stunning detail that is on this piece. So it's somewhat smooth. It's also textured. It's beautiful. It's sort of concave on the inside, but it is a beautiful piece. This is the clasp here, which opens up this way. So it's just lifts, which is that sort of, um, I don't know what that's called, what that style clasp is called, but it just stays in place. And it is an absolutely stunning piece with my hair stuck in it. 
jewelry truly beautiful truly beautiful the next item I'm going to share with you is something I have never shown you and this is an item that I cherish and it was not necessarily expensive but it's all been handmade hand decorated and I picked it up one day at um, a school fair or a school sort of fate that they had at my kids primary school many 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 years ago and this is this lovely container here like this so it is a I don't know it's like a it's a hard plastic I suppose but it is beautiful you can see my reflection it has this beautiful dark effect and it's got all this gold leaf work on the inside of two Chinese ladies with the beautiful work here of the tree in a dark color and then also in a bronze color and in light their dresses are reflective as you can see this could be paintwork which has then been varnished but this has all been completed by hand and at the time she had this size and another larger but I only had enough cash to buy the smaller one and I wish now I had gone back to buy the larger one I've never seen these anywhere else again so if you know where to buy any more of these please let me know the back is just like this it's just got like a sticker on it and it's got the four little felt pads there I am and inside I just use it to store some jewelry pieces so there's a mirror here the inside is all a red felt as you can see there's the mirror and it is just a lovely piece I adore this piece and I wish I had the larger one just to have a set but if you know what these are called please let me know because I intend to find another one so this item here I adore I cherish this item I think it's just beautiful you know it's it's just that thing that was only so low in costs I think it was $35 and I adore it I love it I just keep my special things in here I have other spots for other special things but I adore this container I just adore it the third item I'd like to share with you is this beautiful teal colored bag it's showing up more blue on screen than what it is it tends to have more of a green to it but this is a very very well known the handles are squished because I had it stored that way but this is a very well known design but I don't remember who came up with this if you know please let me know this is that style that was doing the round some time ago and the story behind this I will share with you another time I'll leave that for another video it's part of my series and this is interesting because it's got that ostrich skin effect of course it's not ostrich skin well not that I know of anyway and it's this gorgeous teal color and it's got the beautiful gold lock and it has this feature here opening like this this feels plasticky this gold part here and inside is a very spacious capacity so it's got the two sides it's got the inner zip pocket and it's a very interesting bag this does come with a matching strap but I don't have it at the moment because I'm having the hooks replaced because they broke it's a really lovely lovely bag it has the feet it's got this design this overlap here it's a bag that I often consider selling because it's a style that I just don't wear but every time I see it and every time I hold it I like it it's got that old doctor's bag feel to it oh my gosh I really like it <laughs> anyway so mm. so I hope you found this interesting they're the three items that I've shared with you which are items I've not shared with you before and have significant meaning to me um, head over to Katie's channel if you haven't already seen hers or if you've come from Katie's channel then thank you and welcome and I hope you'll consider subscribing so take care everybody God bless and I'll see you next time bye